How's it going lads and welcome back to a brand new investments guide. Now today what I've got for you actually is the November player of the month, the Barclays Premier League, not the Barclays, but I keep saying the Barclays Premier League, Premier League player of the month investments guide. Now if you guys do enjoy this video, smash over 200 likes, that would be absolutely incredible. You guys did it on the video, not the last video, the video before that, which was just mind blowing. So thank you so much for that. So I thought I'd bring you guys this video to say thank you, basically, and because I wanted to bring this video anyway. So I personally believe that it's going to be either Pedro or Costa. I haven't fully decided who I think is going to win yet, but because they're both Spanish and because they're both from Chelsea, there literally is the exact same place to invest in for both of them. There's no way that you can determine which one you can invest in more because it's not possible to invest in one more than the other because they're both from exactly the same nation and exactly the same team, which makes life a lot easier for when you're investing because it makes it a lot harder to lose coins as well which is very very good as well so what i've done is i've got to invest in two or three 82 rated uh victor valdez is from spain and middlesbrough I then decided to go invest in some Bojans. He's also 82 rated from Stoke because I believe that they'll probably release an 83 and 84 rated BPL team. And to get these guys for like 800 coins now would be sick because I can sell them on later and it'll be like 1,600 to 3,000 coins or something because people will be buying them um, for their uh, squad with the challenges, which is very good. So I decided to pick up two Bojans, one for the transfer list and one for the club because I will be completing the squad with the challenge when it comes out. 100% this one. I didn't do the Hazard one. It was a little bit too expensive, but I do want to do this. This one because I think it'll be mid right mid range price if it is obviously one of the Chelsea boys. Um, and I personally don't see how it can't be one of the Chelsea boys. I believe they went unbeaten during November as well, and I think they won every single game during November, which they're, they're just showing some incredible signs. I think they will de definitely win the league this league um, because they are just showing some incredible, incredible signs of great football. So um, I also went out and I decided to pick up a Juan Mata because not only does he cover the Spanish side because it's 84 rated and you'll need 284s. If it's an 84 rated BPL team, you'll need 284s and 883s and 180 rated. Um, I decided to pick up a Juan Mata because not only does he cover that, he also covers, uh, if in case it's Ebra, which I don't think it will be, but if it is, then he covers Ebra as well and he covers the Spanish side as well. Um, so I thought it was a great pickup and I don't think you'll lose anything on Juan Mata either, uh, mainly because um, obviously the 84 rated being quite a high rating, there's not a huge amount of 84 rated in the BPL and we saw that he rose quite a bit when the Man United one came out, uh, sorry, when the uh, Eden Hazard one came out and you had to have Man United players because um, you had to have an 84 rated team, I thought it was uh, very, very good to pick up him because it wasn't much of a risk at all. Uh, now, one player you can definitely pick up, someone that is a very, very decent idea to pick up. Uh, I think you guys should pick up if you guys do have the coins. I didn't pick one up and I was actually kicked myself for not picking one up. I was like, crap, I should have picked one up. So I'm going to pick one up after this video. Um, it's Nolito. Nolito is a very, very good one to pick up. Nolito is obviously a very decent one to pick up because you got the Spanish 83 rated. So that's that's one thing that's very good. But you also have that he's from Man City. So he covers the uh, Aguero side of things as well. Not only uh, does he cover the uh, Spanish side for Diego Costa, or Pedro, but he covers his, the uh, Man City one for Aguero, which is very good. Uh, I think Aguero is a good candidate, but I don't think Aguero will win it. I just don't think he will. I don't think he can snag it. Um, so personally, I've gone out and picked up the ones that you've seen on screen. I go and pick out uh, an Alonso and a Van Ginkel as well, because uh, I think a few Chelsea players might go up if 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 they are required. Um, so I decided to pick up a couple there. Also, Alonso being Spanish as well, it's, it's a decent pickup no matter what. So I decided to pick those up. And they're pretty much it for the investments. I had about 15,000 coins in the bank. Now, obviously, investing is at your own risk. But let me know down below if you guys want me to invest on certain budgets um, and show you guys what you can get for certain budgets. I decided to do this on about 15,000 coins because I had a few players in my club that I could sell if I wanted to. Like, I've got a Griezmann, I've got a Koscielny and a few other, like, quite decent players. I was like, you know what, now nah, I'll do it on 15k just to see what I can get out of 15k and show you guys what you can get out of 15k as well. So these are the players that I picked up, uh, obviously the Juan Mata and the Pedro you saw and the other players. If you guys did enjoy this video, leave a like down below. If we get it 200 likes, that'd be absolutely sick. Thank you for watching this video and I'll see you later.